G'day, my name's Tater, and I've seen a lot of posts on Reddit and in Discord saying, I bought Final Fantasy, but I don't know how to register, or it's too hard, so I'm just not going to give it a try. Now, yes, I, I understand how convoluted the whole process may be, and how much they don't explain certain things. So, what I'm going to do with this video is show you exactly how to register your game, your version of Final Fantasy XIV. So, let's get into it. Okay, so, first thing you notice, I'm on the uh, Square Enix website. I am on their website for the free trial. So, if you want to give the free trial a crack, here's how you start it up on from their side. Now, bearing in mind, you've got this version of uh, the free trial, and at the same time, you've also got the Steam version of the free trial. Now, here's where it becomes important. If you start the Steam trial, you must only purchase your versions through Steam. If you purchase, or if you, sorry, if you start the Square Enix version, you can only purchase through Square Enix. So, first things first, you'll be on this screen. Now this is very nice. I like it. It gets the point across. Next thing you'll do is you'll click sign up now. You come over to here and you'll fill out all this bit. And once you've once you've done this and you go through the uh, activation through the email, you now have a Square Enix account. Now, from there, you'll be on to this screen. Now, this screen, this is my account. Once you're onto this screen, you may go, oh, account, no. Payment and service fees, register, update a payment method, no. Services and options, well, here's where you go from here. Now you go to Mock Station. Okay, so once you've come from the Square Enix management page, you'll be on, sitting on something like this screen, except all this here will be empty. From here, you'll need to make a service account. Should be just the first one, should only ever need to make one, unless you're planning on running multiple accounts, but I don't understand why you would want to do that. From here, you'll go Manage Service Options. From Manage Service Options, you'll have all of these things. You'll then go come down here to Register Code. You'll then input the CD, quote unquote, the CD key that they sent you, um, or that you have. Now, if you go through Steam, Manage, CD keys, you'll have all of these keys here to slap in. Once you put those keys in, that's it, they're used, but they will appear here. These dictate that you have purchased them. Their website, this page, the, the Mog Station, does not show you which version you were running, so that is on you to remember. I run, personally, I run Steam, so everything I do is through Steam, except for registering the codes. Now, if you come back to this screen, for example, if I go to optional items, it takes you to their online store to purchase in-game bits and pieces. When you purchase things through here, you are purchasing them through the Steam wallet because it comes, once again, it comes in through Steam. But you can still pick and choose your bits and pieces here. So we'll just add this to cart. Yep, that's me. Proceed with purchase to my character, yes. I know, select payment method, agree and continue. I then log in again, and then you have to pay with your Steam wallet. And that's how it's done. And that's it. That is all you will need to know. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully this was helpful to somebody. And if it's not, oh well. If it is, slap me a like, or even subscribe. I stream on YouTube, as I have ceased streaming over on Twitch. So every like and subscription helps me out. Thanks guys, I'll see you next time.